Hi, Lou. Another episode of My Car Story. I'm here today at Volo Auto Museum. I'm with the director, Brian Grams. Brian, thank you for allowing us to shoot your cars. Uh, Hollywood car behind me, the Dukes of Hazard car. If you like cars, muscle cars, etc., come out to Volo Auto Museum in Volo, Illinois. You'll be in for a treat. With that being said, I'm going to jump behind the camera. And Brian, tell us about this car. The General Lee. Well, the General Lee, this is one of the original ones from the very first season. Uh, the first season, they kind of did a pilot. They only filmed a handful of episodes. Wanted to see how the show would take off before they continued. Uh, it was filmed down in Georgia, and there is a total of eight General Lees built uh, for the filming of the first season. This is car number eight. Uh, after that, the filming wrapped up, and they went to California. They started mass producing the General Lees out there. Uh, and they kind of cheapened them. There's a lot of unique things about this car. Uh, when they're in Georgia, you know, they would recycle a lot of the parts. Stuff like the push bar on the front. The first season, it's a lot narrower. Once they came into the second season, the push bar was a lot wider. The wheels on the car are a 14 inch gray wheel. Those were very expensive. So when they started uh, California filming, they went to a 15 inch with a black center that was similar to these, but they're a lot more expensive. The roll bar that's inside this car is actually out of Lee number one. The guy restored Lee number one and he is begging us to sell him the roll bar out of it because uh, you know, it belonged to his car, but you know, they recycled it, put it in our car, so it's history you know, to our car as well. As far as I know, this is the only surviving General Lee with the original Larry West painted graphics on it. When they went to California, they became decals. A lot quicker, a lot cheaper. So this is all paint. This is all paint on this one. This car is exactly as it was back in 1979. It has not been repainted. It has not been restored. This is right off the foot. So I had 1,200 miles put on it since 1979. So this is uh, as original, as nice as you can get for a, for a General Lee. That is great. We actually have people come out that are restoring General Lee's to look at the hand-painted graphics because they want to duplicate, you know, the original person that did it. They want to duplicate the strokes and the brushing. Are we able to pop the hood on yes, this? Yes, Okay, great. I'm going to take a look at the back while you're doing that. Actually, let's take a look at the front. There we go. We're going to get them Duke boys. There it is. Not with this engine. Check out the horns, that famous horn sound. Yeah, everybody thought these were 440s or Hemis. They just used whatever they could find. This is actually a, a 360 that's in this car. 360? Can yep. we get the, uh, can we, can we, does the horn work? No, it's got to okay. be running. For gotcha, that. gotcha. Got to be running for that. Back on the General Lee. Famous antenna. We'll get a shot of the overall car. And there you have it. I'll give you one more shot of the front of the car. Thanks for being on My Car Story.